Fourth of July, the most anticipated event is often some sort of fireworks show. State officials are reminding us to leave the fireworks to the professionals. Lighting them can cause some sort of serious injury. Eyewitnesses reporter Rian Ryle spoke with the police in Belvedere. And what did you learn, Rian? Well, Wendell, we've mentioned the dangers of fireworks before, but now we have the numbers. Over the last five years, the Belvedere Police Department has responded to almost 1,000 firework-related calls for service, with 32% of these injuries being burns. Ultimately, fireworks don't go straight up and come straight back down. A common misconception when choosing to light off fireworks on our own. Belvedere Police have been spreading the word on the dangers of fireworks and how it's important to know what is and is not legal in Illinois. Fireworks kits that you'll find at Walmart, those are the types of fireworks that's going to be uh, uh, legal in Illinois. Sparklers, uh, glow snakes, uh, those things that don't necessarily go up in the air and explode. Once uh, uh, you start to see things that propel into the sky uh, explode, those are the types of things that we're getting calls on and ultimately are going to uh, respond and enforce. Chief of Police Shane Woody says eye injuries are the most reported, and they're often from bystanders or nearby neighbors of the house lighting them off. The inherent danger of lighting something off that is going to come back down either hot or still on fire, especially when it's a dry season, you have the potential for, you know, lighting a, a structure, God forbid, a, you know, a residence either unoccupied or occupied uh, on fire. You know, those are all the dangers that we're trying to prevent and, and some of the reasons why Illinois has taken the stance that they have. Chief Woody also says the primary safety tips for those choosing to have their own show are to light them off outside and have an adult in charge. Never throw or point fireworks at somebody because that's where, you know, some of the injuries come from. Never stand over a firework as you're lighting it. And if uh, a firework uh, doesn't uh, ignite or you think it's a dud, never try and relight it. Another safety tip that Chief Woody shared was that at the end of the night, those who used fireworks should take all of them and submerge them in water to ensure that they are inert before they are disposed of. Wendell? Rianne, some good stuff there. Thank you.